Myra Sokrorwani, the Chief Executive Officer of the Botswana Tourism Board in Botswana. Well, very good evening to you. Um, tell me a little bit about kind of what you're looking to get from uh, the WTT's event here in uh, Dubai. Well, we're looking forward to gaining quite a lot in terms of exchange of international ideas. We in Botswana have got very stringent uh, tourism policy, which uh, are conservation driven. And therefore, it's in our interest to continuously and consistently benchmark best practices around the world. And the WTTC annual summit brings the best brains and audiences from around the world. So it's in our best interest to be attending the seminar to learn. This. Tell me about sort of what you think sort of travel and tourism in general can do to, to kind of um, you know, increase sustainability. Travel and tourism is one of those key sectors around the world which uh, can contribute uh, a lot to the economies of various countries in a fairly different way. It's widespread normally, so it reaches the rural communities and populations. So in terms of creating employment, not just in urban areas, but in those sites and touristic areas that uh, you know it is found, it is very, very unique in that way. And secondly, tourism is labor intensive. And because of that, in terms of uh, in, uh, uh, engaging a, a larger part of the population in employment creation, which is a challenge for all of us around the globe. It is a key sector, if I could just highlight those two uh, areas. And uh, what, what sort of projects are going on right now in Botswana in, in sustainability? The two key projects that are going on are basically to diversify the tourism from the major uh, destinations that are renowned, primarily the Chobe National Park and the Okavango Delta, but into other uh, geographic locations in Botswana. Botswana is big enough and it's got other unique features. So our drive is to drive tourism into those geographic locations. But secondly, and more, more uh, as important, is to diversify the tourism in Botswana beyond the wildlife and the wilderness and the landscapes. We are renowned for wildlife. We are renowned for uh, uh, landscapes and wilderness. We are engaging in now creating uh, opportunities for the culture, the events, the educational and so forth. So those are the key, I think, uh, direct, uh, directions that uh, the strategy is taking us to in tourism. And as the world gets smaller and uh, uh, we see sort of uh, our tourists themselves become more diversified, you know, this evening here in Dubai, you know, we've got many, many of our friends from China here. Tell us a little, about some, a little bit about some of the kind of the new tourists that are visiting Botswana. Where are your new markets? Thank you for the question because emerging markets are very, very, very important. We have our old traditional markets who have been stable, who are there, irrespective of external problems and everything else. But tourism is all about trends as well. So we, are, we have our eye out and our intelligence, market intelligence out for emerging markets. Japan, for instance, has got the highest growth rate into Botswana as we speak. We've got serious, serious inquiries in terms of developing uh, links with India, with China. These are very key emerging markets. Over the last couple of years, we've worked hand in hand with South America, your Argentina, your Brazil, and we've seen uh, good numbers coming into Botswana. But I also must say, Europe has always been a key market for, for Africa and for Botswana. But with the new EU states coming on board, they are quicker in decision making in terms of we want to travel now instead of we want to travel in three years' time. So your Poland, your Czech Republic, your Russia of this world, we've done our research there. These are very, very key emerging markets. That was a fascinating answer. Thank you very much indeed. Uh, I'm really excited about visiting Botswana now from what you've just told me about it. You'll be very welcome. Hope to welcome you back in Botswana soon. Have a lovely event. Thank you.